additional handout, four pages. It summarizes um, the four tests. First is one sample Z test, one sample T test, related sample T test, and then independent samples T test. I'm going to go over these slides um, slowly. You can print them out and then use them as your review um, like a um, handout. So how to determine the hypothesis? How to compute the standard error? How to compute the observed score? This is for one sample t-test. Here is how to form hypothesis for two-tailed test, how to form hypothesis for one-tailed test. How to compute the standard error and how to compute the t-observed score. This page related samples t-test. It is also known as paired sample t-test or matched sample t-test. So here is how to form hypothesis for two-tailed test, how to form hypothesis for one-tailed test, how to compute the standard deviation, how to compute the standard error, one more step than standard deviation, then how to compute the t-observed score. Finally, this is the page for independent samples t-test. When to use test, then how to form hypothesis for a two-tailed test, how to form hypothesis for one-tailed test, how to compute the standard error following three steps, how to compute the t-observed score. So that's the first section of our lecture. Then you can move to the one-way ANOVA. I have one-way ANOVA, one, two, three lectures.